Hey everybody, I'm Derek. Welcome back to my channel. I always feel the need to do a little bit of explaining when I do videos outside of my little shop. I manage these storage units. I live here, just so you know. And you're wondering why I'm in front of storage units. So today for about three bucks, I'm gonna preserve the wood on my trailer to try and get, to get a few more years of use out of it and uh, make it last a little bit longer and make it look a little bit better. So basically you can go down to your Dollar Tree, pick up a tray liner, a paint tray liner, for a buck paint brush paint roller for a buck and get about a dollar in diesel and then you have your already paid for used motor oil that you're hanging on to i didn't come up with this idea it's not original to me or anything like that my dad gave me the idea because he did it to his trailer basically put about 40 percent diesel to about 60 percent of your used motor oil doesn't have to be exact and mix it up in your paint tray and then just brush it on. So I've been saving my used motor oil that I change out of my cars for lots of various purposes. Make sure to use your approved windshield washer fluid diesel container. YouTube so that is pretty much gonna be it for today uh, tomorrow after this sits out in the Sun it's at the end of the day we've got overcast it's monsoon season so tomorrow after it has a little bit of time to sit out in the hot Sun in the morning and for the wood to soak it all in and for it to kind of dry up I'll come back out and I'll show you the results when it's all done all right guys so this is what it looks like basically 24 hours later I had a full day to sit out and bake in the Sun for the pores and the wood to open up a little bit more and to take that used motor oil mixture uh, that I put on it and soak it in a little bit better. I'm pretty pleased with the results. It definitely doesn't look as good as it does on the wood that my dad had that was brand new good wood that wasn't all sun rotted and beaten on by the sun and the weather already like this wood was. Especially, you know, all things considered, it's uh use the motor oil wood stain on his trailer he's been hauling dirt and stuff with that trailer so the dirt and the rock has kind of taken the oil out of the wood so apparently that is a drawback to this 
Um, I'm not sure of too many of too many other drawbacks other than you know possibly slipping down your loading ramp or whatever. <laughs> but uh, I think it looked pretty nice on his trailer on on the projects that he did, and I'm definitely pleased with the results here. It cost me three bucks to put this stuff down, really really cheap, and you know all I'm really I'm I'm recycling some used motor oil, which I think is great. So I'm overall I'm pretty happy with the results, and uh, I think that this oil stain will help protect against the weather a little bit, help make the wood last a little bit longer, as well as protect the wood from the rain because the oil in the wood is gonna uh, repel the rain. Not that we get that much where I'm at, but we do get a little bit. So hopefully it'll protect against all that. Hopefully it'll protect your trailer wood or any wood that you use this on against the weather where you're at. So if you like this video guys, please consider giving me a thumbs up and subscribing. I'd really appreciate it and we'll see you next time. Wow, that's slippery. Wow, that's slippery.